Hello, my name is James, and today we're going to be interviewing people about different mindsets on good and bad sportsmanship. And right after this, we're going to show you an example of good and bad sportsmanship. Miss Sweeney, um, today we're going to be talking about uh, have you ever experienced bad sportsmanship? Yes, I have. And can you give us an example of bad sportsmanship? Yeah, usually when people sit themselves out, they complain, maybe they don't say good game after a game, and they're not very good sports in general. Um, have you ever experienced good sportsmanship? And can you give us an example, please? Yeah, when people are always honest about um, the score in a game or when they say good game after a game that maybe they lost. Okay, thank you and have a good day. You're welcome. I'm here with Dr. Kevin Myers. What do you think sportsmanship is all about? Sportsmanship is about showing humility in the field of competition. Actions of sportsmanship would be after the game shaking hands or during a competition if a opposing team is on the, on the field you help them up and always congratulating one another from doing a good play. Okay. Have you ever experienced bad sportsmanship? Certainly. I think you can see bad sportsmanship not only on the field or competition, but even in the stands. Um, when the stands start saying things inappropriately for the opposing team, I think that's bad sportsmanship on the home team. So I think it expands not only from the field, but into the fans that are there as well. Okay, thank you. Have a good day. Alright, you're both. Make it that you missed it, bro. Yeah. Oh, nice job. You're good. You cut it into it. Oh my. I'm here with Angelo. Um, today we're gonna be asking for you, have you ever experienced bad sportsmanship? No. Um, can you give us a example of what you think bad sportsmanship is? Uh, mocking the team. I think you should be respectful. Uh, whether you're losing or winning, just play the game. Um, what do you think good sportsmanship is? Uh, respecting another team. Uh, they might not be as good as you, but you just focus on yourself. Have you ever experienced good sportsmanship? Yeah, a lot. Um... Yeah, that's it. Have a good day. All right, I'm here with Max. All right, have you ever experienced bad sportsmanship? Yes. Can you give us an example of what you experienced? Yeah, so during the cross, this guy, after the game, he said he started whacking our teammates, and it was just all over the place. His coach started yelling at us. It was not a good thing to look at, bro. Oh, uh, I'm sorry about that. Have you ever experienced good sportsmanship? Yes. Can you give us an example of good sportsmanship? Uh, sometimes there's like referees during games that like only congratulate the winning team, but we had this revs who would like said good game to both sides. It was really cool. Okay, thank you. Yep. Okay. Thank you, referee. Thank you, referee. I'm here with Mr. Scott. Have you ever experienced bad sportsmanship? Yes. Uh, can you give us an example of what you saw? Uh, as a coach or as a player? Both. Okay, as a coach, uh, I would say, uh, you know, for example, if we won a, a soccer match, like yesterday, uh, somebody might gloat or uh, be super proud and put it in the other team's face. Uh, or, you know, as a player, uh, I've seen somebody put somebody else down um, when I was a player, and then I've also seen other players do that. Okay, what do you think sportsmanship is all about? 
Uh, I think sportsmanship is all about is teamwork, uh, raising each other up. Um, you can only be as good as uh, the person who's not playing. So uh, if you're ineligible, you know, then your teamwork, you know, your team needs to help each other out. Uh, try to be positive and do the best you can. Okay, thank you. Thank you. I'm here with Jeffrey, Josh. Um, today we're going to be talking about if you have ever, ever experienced bad sportsmanship and can you give us an example? Yes, um, with soccer and because someone told me that we're, I was, my team was bad playing it. You? Um, wrestling because like a long time ago I was talking to one of the other teams and they said that our, our team sucked. That's actually can, have you ever experienced good sportsmanship and can you give us an example? Yes, um, in wrestling. Uh, one of the teams said we were good, and uh, uh, it was a good match. Uh, yeah, whatever Jeffrey just said. <laughs> okay, good. Um, I'm here with... Angelo. Um, today we're going to be asking you, uh, have you ever experienced bad sportsmanship? Uh, no. Um, can you give us an example of what you think about bad sportsmanship is? Uh... Back in another team, you have to be respectful, but uh, try to enjoy the, the game more, and, and, and uh, yeah. hold on, wait, is that word again? I restart, restart. Oh, we're here with Grayson. Uh, have you ever experienced bad sportsmanship? Yep. Can you give us an example of what you experienced? Oh. Um. I was like in this basketball game, and this dude like decided to like do a hard foul on us because they was losing. Uh, do you know what good sportsmanship is? Yeah. Can you give us an example of what we experienced? Um, 